Tip one, create dashboards in Excel with Copilot. Do you want to create a dashboard in Excel? The sales data has columns for products, sales amount, region, salesperson. First, make sure your data is set as table. If not, select your data and press Ctrl T on your keyboard. Select your sales table, click on the top right button Copilot, then type or click on add all insights to grid. Copilot will generate this dashboard in seconds. Oh my God. Tip two, build stunning charts using Copilot. Do you want to create charts in Excel? Copilot in Excel can do it in seconds. The sales data has columns for products, sales amount, region, salesperson. First, make sure your data is set as table. If not, select your data and press Ctrl T on your keyboard. Select your sales data table, click on the top right button, Copilot. Then we are going to use Show Data Insights pre-made prompt in Copilot in Excel to make some graphs for us. Copilot will analyze your data and give you a chart, which in this case is not that useful, but wait for it. We can then use the Can I See Another Insight pre-made prompt. Copilot gives us a much better pivot chart, which we add to a new sheet. Copilot adds the chart and the pivot table so we can easily make changes. Oh my God. Tip three, simplify pivot tables and data analysis with Copilot. Ever struggled to summarize large amounts of data in Excel? With just a few clicks, Copilot can create powerful pivot tables that do the hard work for you. Type the following prompt. Please provide a pivot table that shows sales by day of the week. I need to know how each day compared to the same day in the previous year in actual dollars and the percentage change in sales. Copilot gives us a pivot table of sales by days in years. It didn't give us a percentage analysis as we asked. Let me show you something cool. Let's first copy and paste this pivot table. Go in the pivot tables fields. Drag the days of week below the rows. Add the sales amount as value as second time. Right click on this new value, go to value settings, click on show value as, select percentage difference from, go to years in the menu, and then select previous as base item. Tip four, Excel data analysis made easy with Copilot. Enter the following prompt. What are my three best products by sales amount? Copilot will analyze your prompt, providing you an explanation of the best products and the results. Press on add to a new sheet and voila. Tip five, write complex Excel functions and formulas in seconds with Copilot. I need a column with a formula that enters downtown over 500 for sales over $500 if the region is downtown. Enter uptown over 800 if the sales in region uptown are over $800. Copilot will analyze your data and generate a formula. Click show explanation and feel free to screenshot right now to understand the whole formula. Press insert column and check your results. Oh my God. Tip six, do you want to merge lists coming from two different systems? This first list contains your client IDs, but the client's names are missing. The second list contains the client IDs and names, but not the transaction amounts. First, make sure your data is set as a table. If not, select your data and press Ctrl T on your keyboard. Then we're going to use Copilot in Excel to merge the list. Enter the following prompt. I have two tables, table one that contains my client ID, but doesn't contain my client name. I'd need help to bring all of my client name that are located in the table two. Copilot will analyze your prompt, providing you an explanation of the formula and the results. Press on insert and voila. Oh my God. Tip seven, write text functions using Copilot in Excel. Need to split or extract text in Excel? Let Copilot handle it. We have the phone numbers and need the regional codes in a separate column. Enter this prompt. Could you create a column with the regional area code of each phone number? It corresponds to the three numbers to the left of the column phone number. Copilot uses the left formula to provide the result. My boss asked me which countries correspond to these area codes. The results are in another Excel tab and I want to bring them over quickly. Could you bring over the country related to each area code? The corresponding data is located in the table regional codes. Excellent, it took two seconds. Now I need these phone numbers split into three different columns. I need to separate the phone numbers. Could you create the following columns? A column for the middle of the phone number. It corresponds to the three characters starting at character number four of column phone number. Also a column for the four last characters to the right of the phone number column. Click on insert columns and bingo. 
Tip 8. Apply conditional formatting in seconds with Copilot in Excel. Need to highlight important data in Excel? Let's use Copilot in conditional formatting. The sales data has columns for products, sales amount, region, salesperson. First, make sure your data is set up as a table. If not, select your data and press Ctrl T on your keyboard. Next, we're going to use Copilot in Excel to highlight and analyze the data for us. Enter the following prompt. I like all sales from cappuccino crew department that have above $1,000 in sales amount in green. Copilot highlights the data in green and then I can filter by color to analyze it further. Let's ask Copilot another question. I like all sales in top 10% in column J. Please put them in pink. Oh my god! If you want to dive deeper into using AI in Excel, watch this video right here. Thank you for watching and if you want to follow a structured, step-by-step approach on using Microsoft Copilot Essentials, follow my course Copilot Essentials from AI Beginner to Proficient. The link is on the screen somewhere or down in the description below. Catch you soon in another video. Cheers!